No, this is great. Um, can't tell everybody how special it is to be back, to be back in Chicago, to be back uh, with everybody here, to be back with the soccer. Um, you know, I've been fortunate enough to, I'm fortunate enough to play soccer for a living, and it's taken me all over the world. I've seen <laughs> countless teams, players, clubs, coaches, um, and and I can tell you all that what we have here at this club with the soccer is is something truly special. Um, and we have David and Batata, uh, Kevin, Art, Ahmed, Todd. You know, forgive me if I missed anybody, but we have these people to thank. And for me, more than anything, uh, this night is about them. You know, it's it's not about myself. It's not about Jonathan. Um, you know, it's not about one team in particular. It's about these these people who put uh, everything they have into this club every day, and and that makes it what it is. And you know, I can still remember the first day, my first day at soccer. Um, you know, my family had just my family had moved to Chicago. It was the winter of 1998, and you know, I have two young sisters, and so you know, we were we were all a little bit nervous, you know. Moving when you're young is, is not so easy. My sisters, they were they were worried, you know? Where are they going to go to school? What was our house going to look like? Uh, who was going to be their teacher? And for me, I couldn't care less about any of that. <laughs> the only thing that I was worried about was where was I going to play soccer? Who was going to be my coach? And was my team going to be any good? <laughs> and so I remember the first day that my parents dropped me off over at Soccer City. And I walked in and I think I got introduced to David, and he said, you know, brought me over to one of the fields, and so, you know, trained for a few hours. And afterwards, I remember, you know, going over to thank David and, and, and wanting to know what the schedule was. You know, was there another, you know, when was the next training, you know, you know when was the game? And, you know, thinking that maybe if I was lucky, there was, there was another training at the end of the week, maybe a game on the weekend. And he looked at me, and he goes, uh, we're here tomorrow. You're, you're, you're welcome to come back. And my eyes kind of you know, popped open. I said, really? You can come back tomorrow? <laughs> and he, he goes, yeah, we're here every day. And so I came back the next day, and the day after that, and the day after that, and the day after that. And at a certain point, I don't think David knew exactly what he got himself into, because <laughs> they couldn't get rid of me. And at a certain point, they must have been thinking, can this kid just stay at home one day? <laughs> and uh, I'll give David and Baton and all these guys credit. If they were ever thinking it, they never showed it. So I thank them for that. Um, and and you know, soccer's became you know, my home. You know, Every day after school, my mom would pick me up. We'd go home. I'd, ch I'd change, and uh, I'd go over. You know, Soccer City, for, you know, back in those days, Forest View. Um, and, and th these are how, this is how I spent my days. And, and along the way, th this was how my family spent, spent time together as well. You know, I mean, uh, I, was, I was speaking with my mom and dad today before, before this started. And, you know, we were all laughing, saying, you know, Friday nights in our family weren't spent at the movies or, or you know, at school dances or anything. I mean, we spent Friday nights at Soccer City till <laughs> 10 o'clock at night watching different games, watching, you know, watching my sisters play. And, and you know, I think this is, this is what makes the, the soccer so special, that it's, it's, a, it's a family club. Every, every person, every player, every family who, who is here feels a part of something special. And... You know, it's it's actually it's still a running joke in our house that uh, you know my sisters had, had there had, there must have been a day where instead of sitting in the car and waiting for me to finish, they had hopped in with uh, one of the younger boys' teams train, and Pete Richardson was actually running the train that day, and so they you know they must have they must have done a little bit of passing a little bit of shooting and now at the end there was going to be a game, and so they made teams and now the you know they're they're playing, and at a certain point. Uh, you know, this, this might have been a B team or, or something at the time, I don't remember. And, and at a certain point, Pete must have said, uh, Hey boys, you want to know why you guys are all on the B team? 
and you know, we all know Pete, we all know he has uh, his, his sense of humor. And, and at this point, everybody kind of, you know, stops what they're doing, kind of looks up, and he goes, because there's no C team, I'll keep working. <laughs> <laughs> and so, the reason that I, I say this isn't to, to give people a hard time, but it's, it's just to let everybody know that the, the moments and the memories along the way with the soccer are, are things that, that me and my family uh, have never forgotten. They're, they're, they're moments, experiences that, that stay with us um, even today. And, you know, like, like David said, you know, so much of, of who I am today as a person, as a player, um, I have everybody here in this club to thank for. Um, you know, the, the qualities that I have, you know, the, the, the things I learned here, um, what it meant to work hard, what it meant to compete, uh, what it meant to leave everything you had on the field every time you played, uh, what it meant to be a leader. All these, all these things I learned here. This is, this is who I am today as a, as a human being and, and as a player. And so, you know, again, more, more than anything tonight, more than it being about any one person, this is, uh, you know, we, we should all honor and, and recognize and appreciate everything that David and Matata, Kevin, Art, Taha, Ahmed, you know, every, everything that these guys give for, for our club, because I, I can promise you all that it's, uh, it's something very special. So. Thank you all for, for having me this evening and uh, enjoy your night.